Well, when asked by a judge why he wanted to change his plea and forego a trial, Pankowski said, quote, I am guilty. By no means do I want to put my family or the victims through the pain and burden. Court paperwork shows that on October 4th, 2019, Pankowski engaged in sexual activity in his Concord home. The victim, a 15 year old girl, and he was aware of her age. During that interaction, Pinkowski created explicit content. In February 2022, a search warrant found numerous photos and videos of child pornography on Pinkowski's two Samsung cell phones. Dozens of the photos and videos were of the 15 year old, some also picturing Pinkowski, as well as dozens of a minor from Massachusetts. The plea agreement says all content will be destroyed by police and restitution paid to victims. Prosecutors say they are still working to identify all of the victims involved. The production of child pornography charge mean, could mean a max of up to 30 years in federal prison. The possession charge a max of 10 years. A judge will sentence Pinkowski on August 28th and he will remain in Merrimack County House of Corrections. Pinkowski is also facing several state charges related to child sexual abuse in Merrimack and Stratford counties. A plea change in sentencing is set in September for Stratford County. We aren't sure which charges he plans to put in a guilty plea for. He's also filed a notice of intent to change his plea in Merrimack County. A date has not been set there just yet. We're live in Concord. Kelly O'Brien, WMUR News. Nine.